When we went over to remote, this was the biggest change in general practice since 1948. And so the question was, what did the media say about it? For patients that forget appointments, there's a lot of literature that suggests that text message reminders or other forms of reminders are actually quite effective at increasing adherence to appointments. In the original paper, we reported only 23,000 people um, who had been coded with, with one of these codes. This group were less likely to be up to date with screening and less likely to have a successful smear. And that's, that's a multifactorial problem. When they went to a GP and the GP said, this is not normal, this is domestic abuse. That was a light bulb moment for many of them, even though the GP might have thought, well, obviously they know all this, they've done all their domestic abuse training. Thinking widely about a range of potential differential diagnoses and not assuming it's long COVID and therefore you must do X, Y and Z. If the duration of the GP patient relationship was more than 15 years, the mortality was 25% lower than if the duration was only one year. Thank you.